Alright, well, I'm not sure how Coal Mining Simulator is going to compare to something like Gold Rush, but it is definitely cool to play yet another simulator game. Hello again there, friends and fans. Raptor here, and welcome back to the channel for a game called Coal Mining Simulator. As the name would imply, we're going to be mining coal and putting it into uh, some big old trucks and bringing it out of the mine. Although this seems massive. These ceilings are like, what, <laughs> like 12 to 20 feet high? Wow, it's like we're in a grand ballroom of a hotel or something. Anyway, thanks for subscribing and hanging out with me. And uh, thank you very much for smashing the like button and just being awesome. It's good to have you all back, and I'm happy to be playing another game like this. We got something called the Drill Rig here. Well, that looks cool. Maybe that's to uh, put TNT into before blowing up the wall or something and then scooping it up with this. Uh, we'll see how everything works. I like how the equipment's all uh, low level too, so that way, you know, we can make the most of this uh, massive ceiling. <laughs> you could literally fit like a standard size uh, wheel loader in here. All right, well, check the tablet and complete your first assignment. Press J for tutorials. Well, I guess we'll go here first. Is this um, a power unit? What is this thing? Looks like it's uh, well, I don't even want to go in there just yet. We'll figure that out in a minute. Okay, let's go inside here and grab our tablet. That'd be it right there. Perfect. All right, so what's our first goal? Let's uh, press J, I guess, and figure that out. This is what we're looking for, though. Press J for tutorials. Move left, back, right, uh, mining mode in X, okay. Uh, underground truck, railroad, hey, all right, we get to drive a railroad vehicle, a loader, a drill rig, a road header. Underground truck is uh, what we saw at the start, so that's like a, more of a dump truck, I guess. So that's where everything will get loaded into. All right, let's see, check tablet to complete your first assignment. All right, well, there's our first assignment. Uh, check the tablet, done. Okay, so now we have to enter the road header. That's this thing with the giant spinning wheels on it. Okay. Oh, it looks like a weapon or something like that. What do we got in here? Locks, some wrenches, tools, a light. Oh, we can actually take that with us? Oh, never mind. I was too hopeful. Wow, what is that? That is the strangest pickaxe I've ever seen. Wow. And is that a European-sized plug? Oh, we must be in a European mine. Okay. Let's see, what else is there around here? Right, I want to check this thing out. Ooh. Oh, is this the uh, train or something like that? What is this? Oh, this is for everybody to go into when you detonate something. Okay. So this is like a, a strong box for people. That's cool. So it's a shelter for when we demo things. Everybody sits in there and then there's the plunger. Okay, that's cool. All right, well, we're supposed to drive over there with the truck. So, what does this do? Oh, we can also repair items. Interesting. Okay, well, let's go ahead and jump in the road header. So that thing seems to shoot materials out of the back and then into the dump truck. Let's take a look here at the uh, drill bits. Oh, yeah, that looks pretty cool. It's going to scrape everything off into the collection unit. And that's going to pick it up and push it through to the back end. It's almost like part harvester and part uh, drill. Okay. Road header. Let's see. Well, I think we can skip the tutorial. I I'm honestly certain we can figure this out ourselves. All right, let's flip everything on. Nice. Start road header. Hey, man, brother. Driving the designated area. All right, now we can get out of this thing. Oh, there we go. I wasn't sure how to get out of there. Well, that looks pretty cool. So that thing is grinding up materials and getting ready to shoot it out the back end. Let's get the truck ready to go. Now, again, remember this uh, simulator is free on Steam right now, too, by the way. So just as a quick reminder, don't forget to uh, download it if you're interested. And uh, go ahead and give it a try yourself. I don't know if this will be coming for anything other than PC. But, of course, I guess the more support it gets the more that people can, uh, you know, get it onto consoles. Upper right corner, we have to worry about money, hard coal, shungite, and something called athrakite? Never even heard of that before. All right, let's fire up the truck then. Probably in the same tradition as the other one. Seatbelt must be worn. Uh, no to safety. Hashtag coal. Renewable energy. Coal-fired power station. Wow. Okay, then. 
Uh, let's see. Let's back her up then. And uh, let's see. Next camera. Oh, perfect. We can look at it this way. Right, we can press C to connect. Oh, there we go. Okay. So we just need to wait for this thing to be done. All right, let's jump out. All right, we'll go over here now and jump back into the road header. It looks like we need to do some more drilling. Mine 20 chunks of rock. Press, press X for mining mode. All right. I see. Ah, there we go. Now, how much of that was coal? I guess we're about to find out. All right, let's go back to the truck. And I think we're going to have to dump it in there. We'll see. Uh, park backwards under the conveyor belt. Yep, so that's in front of us. Okay. Disconnect. There we go. Yeah, the music is definitely repetitive. That's for sure. Let's get ready to flip around. I guess it's nice they gave us lots of space to do this. Wow, that is a huge conveyor belt. Are you kidding me? Wow. All right, let's try that again. I guess we have to be parked perfectly like it were uh, American Truck Simulator or something. It's hard to see though, because like the, though this is a good third person camera, I wish I could use the mirrors, but I don't think we could actually do that. Is there... Wait, are we connected now? Yeah, there's no mirrors, so it's almost impossible. Well, I mean there are, but they don't, they don't really work. I guess we have a backup camera monitor, but that doesn't really seem to work too much else either. All right, let's turn on the conveyor, though. We got it. So we're going to send it back up to the top, I guess. All right. So we're turning on all the systems. All right, park backwards under the conveyor belt. Oh, a.k.a. connect. There it goes. All right, now pick up dumper. What does that mean? Is there a control to lift this? Or is there a new piece of equipment they want me to use? Okay, so they definitely want me to be inside. Oh, it's not pick up dumper. It's more like a raised truck bed. All right, well, that's one of the things done. Oh, we're losing some. Oh, there it goes. Yep. All right, so I wonder if we get paid for that. So probably when it reaches the end of the line, it'll give us money and whatnot accor according to whatever we uh, mine in kilograms of shungite and hard coal, etc. All right, back to the office. All right, I have bad news and good news. Good news is that your uncle's happy with your performance. Uh, it was only a warm-up today. You have to repeat the process until you go through the rest of this rock. It's very important. Okay. So repeat the process till you get to the other side of the rock. Well, that's not necessarily bad news, although it's funny they, l <laughs> they let us uh, leave the machine on. All right, so let's grab the truck. to see if I could repair anything yet. 
Oh, do we leave this truck on all night? Wow. All right, away we go. Let's flip around. There's still more equipment to use, but it seems like we're just using the uh, road header, I guess. But it looks like the other method could be detonation. I see a long tunnel over there we haven't been able to use yet. Maybe soon. There we go. Man, this mine is huge, but seems so small because of all the uh, large equipment. Okay, so we're connected now. All right, back to the road header then until we get to 20. Change the camera mode too for the equipment. That's nice. Well, look at how far we went forward. So I gotta drive to the other side of this rock. So we do gotta hit it a few times. Looks like we've got about 200 kilograms of coal and some shungite. Apparently we were already connected to that machine. I thought we'd have to back it up and fill it up some more, but... I wonder if that's more or less... I wonder if there's a way to tell whether or not you're wasting. But with this truck being so not full, it looks like we'll be alright. Alright, there we go. Is that good? Oh, we gotta wait till it turns green and then connect, yeah. Alright, that's good. This mining part one, by the way, I wanna get to the explosives. Okay, look, oh, okay, looks like we're good with the conveyor. So now we just tip her back. goes. And we do it again. That was 200 kilograms last time, plus 35. Wow, that was 750 now. Oh boy, that was so much more. It looks like we can haul a lot more. A lot more. Right, let's back it up. Massive lights in here too. It would be nice if we uh, could set up lighting ourselves and even do some multiplayer would be nice too. Okay, connect. All right, let's do it again. That's what you get with the simulator. So connecting like this is almost as if it were 
being driven by another person, too. Keep going. Looks like we can just drive ahead. That's cool. Oh, what the hell's that rumbling? That's not good down here. Whew, okay. We did it, guys. I thought that'd be much more tedious. So much for getting all that money out there, but it's all good. Uh, it looks like one of our workers forgot to finish the railroad tracks. Oh. My time to operate the uh, railroad. Press tab to enter management view. Oh. Oh, that's cool, man. Ah, okay, so we have to lay out our own railroad tracks and stuff. So you can see where we busted through. That took quite a little bit of time, so each one of these areas is pretty substantial. There's the conveyor belt leading out. Uh, sell coal in tablet by railroad tracks and place them. Uh, do I have to go back to the tablet in the shop? All right, I guess we gotta run back. Can't carry it with us, I suppose. Obviously, we missed a lot of rock, but it doesn't matter too much in a demo, to be honest. All right, let's sell some coal now. That's 750 kilograms. Pretty good amount. Pretty good. Well, it looks like we can hire workers, too. I assume that's under trade. Buy new land, buy new levels, loans. Uh, private enterprise will buy it for a lot of money. So we'll sell all that we got. I wonder what Shungite is. Nobody will buy it though, so, but whatever, we got enough money. Okay, so shop. Ah, so we can buy gas detectors, screwdrivers, pipe wrench, wrench and socket wrench, so that's for our repairs. Uh, we've got our drill rig, road header, underground truck, railroad truck, and loader, which we have some of that already. There's our railroad tracks. They wanted me to buy 14 of those. There we go. Fire extinguishers, security compartment. Mine telephone and fire alarm. Wow. Okay. So now let's place those railroad tracks. Can we do that for management mode? Oh, yeah. But we need to make sure we do it from the right place. All right, let's go see. And if we need more cash, that truck is ready to go. Okay, so it should be from here. This 
so they want me to make a track all the way around. Now it looks like the uh, corner piece is already ready to go. I guess they want it in this spot too, okay. Alright. Press tab and return and deliver dynamite. What? Oh, is this thing packed with TNT? Oh, it is. Well, there's coal there, but TNT's in the back. Uh, let's see. Yeah, we'll figure it out. It'll be funnier this way. Okay. Power's on. We're going forward. Headlights are on. Let's go. Oh, this is cool. And we can actually lay out our own mines, purchase railroad tracks, and then deliver TNT or whatnot in order to blow open massive sections of the rock. Doesn't look like we can uh, roll, though. 10 kilometers is about our top speed, I suppose. Exit the cart and fix lighting. Uh oh. Ah, we're gonna need a screwdriver or something. Or just turn it on. Oh, there we go. We have headlights, though. Alright, back in the old chair. The hot seat. There we go. It looks like a giant Lego on the back of the minecart. Probably just a battery. You don't really want a lot of exhaust down here if you can help it. One less thing shooting out fumes is probably a good idea. Alright, exit the cart and pick up crates. Uh, pick up first crate with dynamite. Oh, from the back? Place it under the table. Dynamite! There we go. Oh, no, these are just hot dogs. Oh, wait, no, they're just firecrackers for the kids. Kids, it's 4th of July. Report to your office for the next day. What? Come on, I want to do it now. Jeez, all right. Well... Eh, let's see. Let's get back to the office then. Here comes our uncle again. Blah, 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 blah. We'll figure it out, uncle. Alright, enter the loader to transport leftover rocks. This thing? Wait, did, did we use the TNT? Oh, this is weird. You get into this thing from the front like that? Oh, that's weird. And the pedals are right in front of us. That is cramped, man. Alright, collect leftover rocks. This thing is weird. This looks like something the Joker would drive in Batman. Like the animated series. Are we picking these up or what? Oh, that's it? Okay. It's kind of articulated. You can kind of see it trying to like articulate, but it's it like articulates between zero and one degree. <laughs> In either direction, too. It's like, wow. What a piece of technology. Okay, good to go. Uh, turn it off. Open her up. Oh, now we get to start drilling. Okay, it's time to do dynamite. This is going to be cool. Let's take a look at this thing again. Yep. Perfect. I don't need your tutorial. All right. 
this thing's got a little bit more control. So we can switch drills, push in and out, reset. So I assume what we're doing here is we're going to dig some or drill some really long holes, pack it with TNT, and then come back with that uh, little front loader. Park next to the rock. You want me to get out or what? Don't really have a parking brake, but alright. Huh. Also, it says day one. Uh, hasn't it been like three, two, three days in the game already? Let's fire up the drills, see if we can do this without them. So let's see. Reset drill. Ah, oh, they want us to quote unquote connect. Yeah. Insert dynamite into rock. I didn't even do anything yet. Shouldn't I um, do that after we drill? Unless we're just sticking it to the side. Try the right drill. Oh, there we go. What the hell? I don't think that worked as intended at all. I was able to point the drills on the rock, but I guess we were. I guess the TNT was in the tips of the drill? Oh, it seems incredibly dangerous. It seems like that should work differently, but I get the point. All right, yeah, it seems like something you could have firstly done by hand, but you can see all the cable behind this machine, so that's where the debt cord, basically. Well, not really, but you know what I mean. That way you can push the uh, TNT deep into the rock and then it'll connect it back to the uh, vehicle. And then tie it off back there to the uh, to the detonation house. All right, let's see how this works. I, mean, I should probably shut this door. Don't want it to get dusty. All right, let's fire off that TNT. Close the door and det detonate the dynamite. All right, let's do it. Looks like we got plenty of oxygen in here too. Boom. Thank you for playing the demo version of Coal Mining Simulator. And thank you guys for watching. Well, it's like a little brief uh, demo of a game that's coming soon. I like the whole management aspect of it. I want to see more games like this, though, that pursue something that I haven't seen a lot of games do. I think I've seen, like, tunnel simulator games before, but would really like some more underground simulators of mining material like coal and iron ore and whatnot and actually bring it to the surface. Uh, this is good, but I want to see more. And I will see you all next time. Thanks again for subscribing, smashing that like button, and uh, just hanging out in general. And I'll see you all next time. Thanks again, guys. Have a good afternoon, good evening, and a good night. Bye-bye.